keep your hope. I think in um, any moment of adversity, like everything is temporary. Uh, so I know the world entirely is sending hope to everyone out there. So I would say keep it up. Um, do you know how many days war in, your, in Ukraine is going on? What do you think approximately? Um, I would say like 60. A hundred days if uh, I have uh, understand well. A hundred days. That's uh, correct? Yeah, I don't know what is wrong with that Putin. They got their independence back in what? Was it 90 something? I can't remember, but why is he trying to take it back from them? You know, I don't understand. And targeting old people, children, you know, people that are already down and out and, and people in hospitals. And I don't know what is wrong with the man. Well, to be honest, I think that only God will be able to help. And um, hopefully the rest of humanity can help as well. But ultimately, it's only Jehovah God who can help everyone. If you could say something to the people of Ukraine and they would hear you, what would you say? I say hold on, uh, never surrender, and uh, and I know people from Ukraine is really beautiful and and they will win if if the if they try if, if keep going fighting. I tell all my support, of course, and uh, and uh, all my thoughts to to the people of Ukraine. How about Russians? If you could approach Russians. I don't know if it's all the Russians that are at fault, probably just a few. And uh, there again, I don't know what to think of that, I guess, so. Russian, but I think people of Russian, but they are not, for, for, it's not their fault, you know, it's the government of Russia and uh, it's the fault of Putin, it's the fault of uh, all the government and all the people that support him. And uh, I think it's, uh, it's very difficult for the Russian people too, who are uh, against war, yeah. I think the Russian people needs to, you know, be aware of what's going on outside their country and understand the political areas and political issues going around, you know, and, and to see what one individual can do, you know, have all this power. Let's, let's work out relationships. I think we're at a moment in history where we have more than proven record that war, war is not an option, um, shooting each other is just absurd.